This is problem four of chapter 16 from the textbook Stats Modeling the World, second edition. Okay, so we're going to play a game. This time we're going to roll a die. If, it, if we get a six, we're going to win $100. If not, we roll again. If we get a six the second time, we get $50. And if not, uh, we're out of luck. Nothing. So before I create the probability model, which is what they're asking, I'm just going to model this situation with a tree. Okay, so uh, so I get a, if I get a 6, the probability of that is 1, 6. And I win $100. Okay. Uh, if I don't get a 6, so let's just say not 6, the probability of that is 5 out of 6. 5 divided by 6. Okay, so then we roll again in that case. And if we get a 6, so the probability again, each roll of the die is independent, as you can see from the tree, and we get $50. Okay, and then if we don't get a 6, well, probability of that is 5 out of 6, and um, we don't win anything. We get zero dollars. So the probability of a hundred dollars is one six. The probability, I guess, of fifty dollars is five over six times one over six. So that's going to be five over thirty six. And then the probability of winning nothing is 5 divided by 6 times 5 divided by 6. So that's going to be 25 over 36. So just if you were going to check, if you multiplied this by 6, this by 6, you would have 6 here. So 5 plus 25 is 30 plus 6. Is 36. So we know they add up, the probabilities add up to 1. So our tree is sound. So then if x is the amount that you win, the random variable, amount that you win, then we could do a, a probability model. Okay, so we're going to win $100. That's 1, 6. Or we're going to win fifty dollars and that's uh, that was five out of thirty six or we're gonna win zero dollars and that's gonna be twenty five out of thirty six so this is the probability model okay so now the expected value of playing a game is a hundred dollars times one six plus fifty dollars times five divided by thirty six plus zero dollars times twenty five over thirty six and that comes out to be twenty three dollars and 61 cents. Okay, so they didn't ask us to do the standard deviation on this, but they what they do say is how much would you be willing to pay to play this game? Well, uh, I would say that if I were going to play, if I play a lot, I would not um, I would want to pay at least or at the most right at at the most at the the 
at the most um, $23.61 to break even. If I wanted to win, I'd want to pay less than this. However, um, if um, if I play just a few games. I would not want to pay very much. I mean, we really need the standard deviation to see, but um, you know, if you're only going to play a few games, because the expected value is what you would ex expect if you played many games. So it could be that you win a lot less than this, um, and so that's more likely if you only play a few games. Okay, so that's my answer to this problem. The main thing I want to make sure you see is how to use a tree to create a probability model. Okay, good luck.